The St. Bernard Parish Sheriff's Office says they seized these drugs, cash, and other paraphernalia from Tyron Wiltz and his mother, Danielle Brown. They say they first arrested Wiltz during a traffic stop last Thursday. At the time, deputies say he had about $8,000 cash on him, six pounds of marijuana, dozens of ecstasy and Xanax tablets, as well as a sawed-off shotgun. A search warrant was issued for their home on the 3500 block of Laplace Street in Chalmette. I was inside taking a nap. When I came outside, I seen all the police. They had cops from one into the other, undercovers. Deputies say at the home, they found Wiltz's mother, Danielle Brown, to be in possession of more than $18,000 in cash, similar drugs with the intent to distribute. This is an unusual amount of money and marijuana that was seized. It's approximately $50,000 street value and more than $26,000 in cash. So this is a big arrest. This is unusual um, to have this amount recovered in St. Bernard. Kim Gritter with the sheriff's office says Wiltz is no stranger to their department. Earlier this month, they say Wiltz was involved in a wild car chase. She says he was arrested after he tried to kill two St. Bernard Parish deputies. Wiltz, um, who was traveling at a high rate of speed, uh, rammed one of the patrol cars with his car um, and then tried to ram a second unit with his car.